Welcome back to the past. Oh, we're learning man. about Mizuki. We're getting some Mizuki lore. Mizuki, Exciting. Mizuki. I keep, I keep saying it completely it's, different. I each don't line. know. It's, it's, it's whatever. It's the same thing. Oh my God. Was she just beating people's asses? I don't know. Who did this to you? Oh. F some kids at school. Five or six of them. Oh my God. What the fuck? Did she just get fucking jumped? I said ah. I was a weirdo because I don't live with my mom and daddy. What the hell? The and they teased me. And I got mad and I told them to go away and they hit me. Bruh. Tell me their names. <laughs> right now. Yeah, right fucking now. I'll teach the little punks a lesson. All right, wrong response, Dante. Pull out the gun. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Date, wait. Adult intervention will not solve this problem. Why not? Mizuki has to deal with this problem herself. Well, I mean, sure, but also, shouldn't they be punished in some form? I mean, most of the times, I would say if you are being bullied, you would tell adults. Adults would sort of handle the situation by, you know, keeping an eye on the yeah. kids. But, but yeah. I don't know. Mizuki, come on. It's time to train. Oh, so he's the one who got her bench in 220. Oh, shit. What? I'm going to teach you how to kick their asses. We're starting right now. <laughs> That's a fair response, too. Oh, my I, God. I'm... This is... I mean, what do you do, right? Like, you just yeah, have well. to teach the kiddo how to defend themselves. Oh, okay. Yeah. So we were doing full-on, like, judo shit, huh? I guess so. So that's why she's actually kind of insane with it. All right. The shrine is the perfect place for special training. It is? You feel better when you train in quiet, serene places like this. It's fair. Sure, whatever. <laughs> First, I'm going to teach you four secrets to becoming stronger. Follow these four yes. rules. Yes. And you will acquire power beyond your wildest dreams. Sensei! Sensei Date! Yeah. <laughs> Date, are you playing a character or something? <laughs> it's like Karate Kid right now. No. Yeah. I'm not Date. <laughs> While we're in training, I am Master. <laughs> it's it your Karate Kid, okay? Uh, Do the thing! My god. Well, this was the same shrine, though. Uh, right. oh, well, it kind of yeah, looks look, like see, it. Look at the monument, yeah. the Iris Monument. This is the Chozu, yeah. Can you look at the Iris Monument? Iris Monument? Yeah, it's the one where all the irises are oh, blooming. Oh, this? Yeah. yeah. Pretty flowers are blooming, wow. What um, does it say? Oh, the monument. What does it say? When riding an elevator, oh. mashing the door close button doesn't actually do anything. Hmm. That's what it says. You're lying. <laughs> Aren't you? <laughs> really? <laughs> well... We'll hmm. never know. All right. We'll never know. Um, the key to victory is to kill the heart. Oh no. Um, um, and maybe this will change the way that she speaks. Mental I preparation is know. important. Yeah, I say Every, so. Your everyday life is in a fight. You must first be victorious in your mind. Mm-hmm. Like thinking I'm not gonna lose. Exactly. Mm -hmm. I do the same mental preparation before going to the <laughs> I will not before lose my I money. In, if I tell myself that they're all out of my league, then they will be. <laughs> the mental fight has begun the moment I put my hand on the door. God, he's so right. Yeah, I see. <laughs> Actually, God. no. That's stupid. Yeah, it is a little dumb. Yeah. Um... Everyday life is of dire importance. What? Why? <laughs> the best training you could ever have is to be mindful during your everyday life. Diet and exercise form a strong body. Yeah, I know that. Oh, you I, mean you IRL, soda boy? I, <laughs> 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 oh, diabetes. It's uh, coming diets for are me. hard, man. Diets are hard. Mm-hmm. You will always be able to anticipate your enemy's first move. I get it. Mm-hmm. But you're so messy. <laughs> Does that mean you can't fight? Well, he's all right at it. He's not like crazy crazy. 
Hark, the blowing of the wind through the tree. All right. I like this voice. I'm like mesmerized by it. Very good, yeah. It's got good resonance. Mm hmm. Uh, the key to victory is to kill the heart, I guess. I guess we gotta say all of it, though. Like, when you get into a fight, aim for the heart? I mean, you could, I guess. No, let's no, go. It's the opposite. <laughs> Never mind. Okay. You must kill your own heart, Mizuki. Oh. What do you mean? If you are going to fight, you must suppress any mercy mm -hmm. or emotional attachment. Kill them all. If you have even a mote of sympathy within you, it will be impossible to fight to your potential. Do not think of your <laughs> opponent as a man. Mm -hmm. Think of them as a target, a punching bag or a board. Yeah. No oh. human. You're not a human. <laughs> Stop Beat thinking about their ass. emotions and feelings and family and yeah. life and children. <laughs> Just a punching bag. Huh. Yeah. Um, being quick to act is crucial. Mizuki, do you know how to win any fight against No, anyone? she doesn't. That's why she wants you uh, to teach her. Um, don't get in a fight in the first place? Hmm? That is a respectable answer, <laughs> but no, the way to win any fight is this. Pull your pants down. Okay, you that's understand, what I've heard. You understand she's nine, and this is a very strange response I understand for you to that. just have. I understand that, but mm. even as a young child, I learned if you're in a fight, pull your pants down. I don't think that works when. I don't think that works with everybody, Hayden. You don't think so? No. Because I th I think if you pull your pants down, like, instantly, you win the fight. I'm not going to lie to you. I don't... I... No. Can you tell dude. I've never been in a fight? I... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just... That has got to be the worst advice you could ever give a child. I'm just saying, if you're in a fight, pull your pants down. People are going to think you're that weird. Is... They're not going to fight you. Simple. L literally. You know what my friend is, though? My friend. Oh? Um, my friend was a very, like, flamboyant individual. Okay. Um, you know, and he used to uh, get picked on all the time by these, you know, ignorant little bastards. And eventually he caught on and was all like, oh, okay. So anytime that they were to hit him, he would just moan sexually. <laughs> and then they never touched him again. Never That's touched him again. Do I, it. I feel like there is a, um, you know, th there is some tactic to, you know, doing it like that make them kind of weirded out but exactly. when it comes to a child i don't think removing their clothing is quite the right answer <laughs> i will just say that either that or you go blah, 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 blah. Uh, you know what i actually like that response a little bit better yeah, that's pretty good i think that's there pretty you good go. there um, you go. become the tasmanian devil yeah if you become taz they simply will not even come near you yeah just eat eat the you know dirt eat the dirt get out and just eat the dirt and then they'll be like i don't think i want that one Okay, yeah. but then the ultimate combo is doing both. <laughs> Once again, I don't think the removal of clothing is a thing. I'm just saying. But... I'm just saying. I've, this is what I've learned in my in my days as a young white boy. It, hit them first, I'm so glad you're safe. You know. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I kind of get it, but. Of course, I'm not saying that's how you should behave. <laughs> but thinking about this will make a big difference in a real fight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, I get it, but... Seriously, Date, are you, like, acting or something? <laughs> it's not Date. It's Master. Master! It's Sensei! Anyway, practice these four truths, and you will get stronger. This sounds like a scam. <laughs> Believe in it me. It's a fucking pyramid scheme. Now you have to pay for more. Yeah, it's one of those say, like mall karate teachers, you know? Yeah, exactly. Are you sure? And then you need to bring more people in and tell them join my little course. And how about we do a baseline test? Show me what you've got. Okay. Huh? How? Punch him in the tummy. Uh, let's see. How about you throw a punch? I can guess your strength from that. Do it! If you say so. I mean, she's quite shot. strong. Well, not at this point, I would think, right? I don't know. First, close your <laughs> eyes and concentrate. Like this? Okay. Exactly. Yes! Then, punch forward. <gasps> oh 
Holy fuck! Jeez, man. What? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Fuck! That, that face! Cool. They just completely changed the art style. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> That's, that's gotta be the thumbnail. That's a good yeah, thumbnail. Um, you just gotta move your little fucking marker away. It's always impossible to do a thumbnail like that because you always okay, hover it over the well, character. Sorry. You're making it impossible for me. There's so many thumbnails that I wanted I'm to sorry. do with your fucking cursors right there. I'm and I can't sorry. Google AI the Somnium files because if I do, I get fucking spoilers. Move your cursor. Make it easier for daddy. <laughs> Daddy wants thumbnails! Why aren't you letting me have it? <laughs> um, um... You don't have to be nice. No, that's... Uh, you literally broke the sound barrier or something. <laughs> I know I'm weak. Um... Uh, hey, by the way, did you swing back at those bullies? No, I didn't do anything. Well, that would be... yeah. There were a bunch of them. I didn't think I could. I see. She doesn't know her own strength. Yeah. I suppose not. Mizuki, let's just say I think you should be more confident. She in is a simple freak of nature. Mm -hmm. I don't know how this happened. Really? But she's kind of insane. But no. never ever strike your master. Yes. That is a must. <laughs> <laughs> you would kill me. <laughs> please don't <laughs> hurt me, please. Yeah, you're right. In fact, you're so strong, you scare me sometimes. Well then? No, I can't take you with me. Why not? You're still a child. Because I took responsibility for you. I promised Renju. I can't put you in danger. Uh, well, Renju's not really around to say nothing now. Actually, how is this going to work? I mean, like, it is... I don't know how stuff works in Japan, but like normally when the parents are gone like that, there has to be a legal guardian. There has to be right. Uh, I mean, she's a kid. She's yeah. I don't know. Maybe maybe Dante they made Date adopted? sign something. Maybe I don't know. That's not fair. Bringing up daddy. But Iris and Ota feel the same way. Yeah, they don't want you hurt either. You have to understand, Mizuki. If I need your help. I'll let you know when the time comes. When you need to beat some ass. No. Really? Yes. Promise? I promise. Let's go, Iva. Let's get out of here. Where to? I don't know, actually. Are we just going to the... Yeah, okay. I was yeah, about to say. that makes sense to me. Just go to the headquarters. We didn't get a ramen, though. No. Ah. A shame. No. I like Mizuki. I, I just, I think she would be safer closer to us. I, I'm real worried Before about that. No. Yeah. Let's summarize our investigation so far. Okay. All right. Um, about Mayumi. Mayumi is suffering from dementia. Mm -hmm. If Mayumi followed Ota and Iris, it is highly likely that she saw the person in the polar bear costume. But she don't remember is the problem. What? Mm -hmm. Well, Somnium. Hold up. Gosh, you know, how would that even work with someone with dementia, you know? I'd, that would be kind of insane. I feel like it would just be so, like, Staticky fragmented. And, yeah. yeah. Um, it would be fascinating. I wonder if, um, I don't know, maybe it could cure something? I don't know. Ah, well, possible. But she might not remember. Correct. I mean, we cured Iris's brain death until, of course, you know, she just died. But no, yeah, something happened there, but I don't know. Hmm. Uh, about so. There is only circumstantial evidence linking So Sejima to the new cycle of serial killings. I agree, but there has to be more to it. Yeah, something's off. Something's weird. Kumakura's had connections to both victims. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So has a connection to the Kumakuras. There's a common link there. They have to be involved somehow. There's a bunch of connections. It's just a matter of figuring out how the connections, uh, you know, actually so might have connections to did virus. shit. Mm. Yeah, it's essentially like taking a web of events and yeah, well, yeah, and trying to tie them together. Because so <laughs> appeared in Iris's song. Yes, with his it's choker just... and boobs. I'm trying to look at all of what we're seeing here because it's just a. 
a weird collection of people, right? Like, the yellow jacket makes me concerned because of Mizuki. Um, yeah. Obviously, you know, the, the body shape isn't quite yeah. right, but... I don't know. It just I... seems like it's a, a weird formation of everyone Iris knows. Hmm. Hmm. About so again? Oh. Okay. I am more interested in the hired guns that so uses as bodyguards. Sure. Why? Perhaps they are... I did some research and discovered that Mr. Sejima hires substantial security. Hmm. If all of his security staff are this heavily armed, Yakuza gangs pale in comparison. Okay. I thought the Yakuza gangs were part of that security. Maybe, hmm. maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just making assumptions. Is hmm. someone trying to start trouble? Well. Unknown. But there is definitely more than he is letting on. For sure. Absolutely. Um, about Mizuki. Mizuki did not have any new information about Okiura Fishery. Currently, it seems there is nothing linking that company to Renju. Hmm. Hmm. Herm. Still, something's not right. A lot of things aren't right. Yeah, but I feel um, more confident in this timeline besides the Somnium route. Um, right. Yeah. I'm feeling, but yeah, I don't know. Things seem to be working there out. There's an important piece of news. What is it? The Odoroki Man chocolate found at the warehouse. Okay. Fingerprints oh. found on it. Oh, God. Okay. Uh-oh. Who's? Who's? Okay, okay, okay. Okay. All right. What? Mayumi bought the chocolate at the convenience Which means store she, 12 on Koshu. She was in the fishery. Yeah, she would have to be. She was there. Would, would she have possibly been the polar bear? <laughs> That's... I know it sounds silly, insane. but it, 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 she technically could have? She, she might could be have someone. Been. Dude, she might be the next Somnium person. You might be right. It's got, I mean, it would have to be, no? What, what a fascinating idea, but yeah. What the this hell? This was captured on security footage. 812 stores are commonly called 8s. Oh, so... Uh, 7 Eleven, huh? Yeah. Eight is not far from the Famisto where Ota stole the station wagon. Hold on a second. I'm having trouble keeping the facts straight. Hmm. Allow me to summarize. Okay, cool. Please. Oh. Please do. The chocolate was purchased yesterday at 10 33 p.m. So that was. It's a pretty large gap. Yeah. That's the same time Ota stole that car. Right. Correct. What conclusions can we draw from that? Unknown. Great. All that is known for certain is that Mayumi bought the chocolate at an eight store last night. And then, right? But so Oda was over here. No, Oda was. Yeah. Well, I mean, he was at that parking lot. Right. Um, he was stealing a car. Yeah, with her. At the same store. Hmm. And that same chocolate somehow ended up in the warehouse. Did hmm. she go there and drop it? It is possible. I mean, she must well. have, right? But both cars didn't have any additional fingerprints. So would she have just walked there? Or drove away? Hmm. It just seems odd. This seems like such an odd way to do this something happened in between i mean that was a massive gap of time very massive yeah so many things that could have happened yeah um boss oh sorry to interrupt your brainstorming but there's a call from the boss the boss connect me date did you hear that iris's operation is over yeah yeah i heard about it at the hospital she made it right yes but she's still unconscious hmm She's currently in the ICU. No visitors allowed. Fair enough. All right. Ota, however, seems like he Oh, can, can he? Is All that right. Treatment? Yeah, he's in a general. Are we going to make him a somnium patient? Oh, well, oh, I'll dive into that brain so Got fucking it. fast. Do you want to see that? Oh, oh do. I'm curious. I'll meet you there. Oh shit. Even though there's some probably real fucked up shit in there. Yeah, there'd have to be some creepy shit, man. No. Sorry. Right, I don't know. I'm it. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, it's your thing. You have to. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have even been speaking. That was rude of me. Yeah, I um, know. Like, what the fuck? You you just were speaking over the new. I know, and it's the most important part of this gameplay. It really is. I yeah. think so. Um, oh, God. All right. Uh, How are you feeling, Otter? All right, pause it here, bud. Oh, man. We have to end it here. But next time, we get to interview your favorite person. Uh, All right. Bye, guys. Bye.